Very, very pleased to get the, uh, the win. Uh, it didn't look like uh, it was going to happen for a very long time um, and to score at the end obviously was uh, you know, very relieving and very pleasing. Um, but great credit due to, to Scotland, the way they, they played, especially in the physicality stakes, they, they put us under severe pressure. And, um, and, and on top of that, then the weather conditions, you know, didn't, uh, didn't lend itself to, uh, to an open free-flowing game. So, um, you know, it's, uh, it's just one of those days. Um, but to get away with a win and get away with a bonus point, um, you know, we'll take that, obviously. Uh, but we've got a lot of work to do before we... Uh, you know, can entertain uh, being competitive against Italy next week. You know, turnovers uh, is one form of discipline. You know, ball security, but also the uh, the discipline of not giving away penalties and silly penalties at that. That you know, we conceded a lot of territory. Um, there are two areas that we're we're, we're going to obviously have a look at and, and hopefully improve on for next week. But uh, I can't uh, I can't say enough about the you know how the how the girls uh, stayed in the game. You know, they were they were on the back foot pretty much the whole of the second half, and um, and to have got the win at the end, uh, there's great credit due to them, and that just goes to show the the type of character. That's that's in the squad that we didn't play well um, you know and arguably we didn't deserve to win um, or draw but um, but thankfully we got it and we'll take that and we'll uh, hopefully build them you know we spoke at half time you know about um, you know the areas that were kept costing us uh, points uh, thankfully we kept uh, Scotland to, to, to no score in the second half um, albeit they, they missed a few kick, kickable penalties as well but um, you know from a try point of view you no, know, we didn't concede anything and that was the main priority that if we if we kept them scoreless that we would have uh, we'd have an opportunity uh, to hopefully get a uh, equalising score and then you know go for the winner and uh, and that's what happened and uh, you know there was great credit due to the girls um, again I can't say I, I speak highly enough of them how they how they dug in uh, we knew we weren't playing well but we uh, we just tried to batten down the hatches and try to focus on just certain areas of the, of the game to actually get us over the line and thankfully we did well, obviously we look at it from a technical point of view and see where the, what areas we need to really sharpen up on but also then you know we're looking for a bit of a a bit of a, a backlash from the from the players themselves to, to, to show that you know while tonight wasn't pretty or it wasn't good. Um, you know, it was a once-off, and uh, and we'll uh, hopefully put ourselves, you know, in, in with a great chance to actually be competitive against Italy. Italy away is very, very difficult, um, but we'll have to be at our best because uh, performance like that tonight, I don't think, will be good enough against Italy.